Hello YouTube and welcome to ICN. It's me, Thursday. It's hmm, what week is it? It's week 95. God Luke, you're an idiot. Week 95 and it is Twilight versus Harry Potter week. Um and what have I got to say on the subject? Twilight sucks. Harry Potter's pretty cool. See y'all next week. Oh, you're still here. Oh. What do you want to know? It's Twilight versus Harry Potter. I mean, they're both books turned into movies. Now, that in themselves means they're both successful. Obviously, understanding the fact that they've become well popular enough that they've been made into movies is them being a good thing. Right? But, it all comes down to personal opinion, really. I mean, Harry Potter has tens of millions of thousands of fans. But then again, so does Twilight. Obviously, Harry Potter is going to have more fans at the moment. Because Harry Potter came out first. Alright? Let's say if they came out at the same time. You never know. But, my own personal opinion, Twilight... Pardon my French, can go suck a donkey's ass. But, um. The book itself, I read one of them, and I was like, yeah, this is rubbish. This is complete bullshit. They, they've taken the great stereotype of a vampire from. You know, the, old, the old Dracula. Right? Who was the original type of vampires, and they've. And then it's continued, they've slightly changed, you know, and then they become Twilight vampires, and now they sparkle and have emo all the time. That can go suck balls. Right? Vampires used to be something I wanted to be. About five minutes ago, I just got back from my dance competitions, that's what I'm doing this week, in which I was a dancing as a vampire. I had the, a pale face, um, sh uh, lines on my cheekbones to make you look. Like this, um, and I had red under my eyes because when vampires cry, they bleed from their eyes. They have no living, um, they have no water in their body. They have no living um, stuff in their body. They are dead. So what they bleed is not what they bleed is that what they cry is their blood. Um, so yeah, I had red under my eyes. That's why I'll be explaining why I like a bit of a bit like a drug dealer, a, a drug addict. I know. So, uh, yeah. But, yeah, no. Twilight has turned vampires into something that's gay. Not gay as in, woohoo! Gay as in just not good. Just bad. Sucky. Wrong. I mean... The, like... The idea of vampires, have, have, they've been bringing them back. They've been bringing it back from Twilight into something quite cool. I mean, there's... Recent things like the Vampire Diaries, were, which were, um, they were shown, it was a series on sci-fi or something like that, it was a pretty good series, it portrayed vampires as more badass, more, um, in modern day they portrayed them more as, you know, badass people, not, not, not fancy sparkly twats, um, and then was True Blood, that shows them as the badassest things in the world, um, so you know, I mean True Blood is awesome. Not only does it show vampires in their awesome light, but then it introduces these other um, magical things. I've got blood in my hands, but it's not actually blood. But it, yeah, it introduces all these other magical things that aren't actually as magical as vampires, but they are linked in. But yeah, no. Harry Potter twi versus Twilight. Harry Potter wins every time, mainly due to the fact that it's a fucking awesome series. Read the books, watch the movies, but read the books first. Never watch the movies and then read the books. Because you're like... I didn't know that happened because they took things out and blah blah blah. blah. Um, but anyway, Harry Potter, tw no Twilight, no Harry Potter. Well, oh, Harry Potter and Twilight. Twilight can suck balls. Harry Potter rocks. End of story. Bye bye. See you all next week for a non-theme week, and stay frosty. Check you later.